Welcome back everybody to the fire extinguisher enthusiast. Today I will be talking all about water mist fire extinguishers. First off, water mist fire extinguishers are rated for class A ordinary combustible fires and class C electrical equipment fires. And so you may think to yourself, well doesn't water conduct electricity? That's the thing about water mist fire extinguishers is that they use deionized water, which is water that does not conduct electricity. And also, when the agent is discharged, it comes out in a mist, which means that electricity cannot travel back up to the operator. Another thing about the agent being discharged in the mist is that it will not scatter the burning material everywhere. Water mist fire extinguishers are also MR conditional, which means that they are non-magnetic and can be used in an MRI environment. There are two main sizes of water mist fire extinguishers, the 1.75 gallon like I have right here, and then the 2.5 gallon like pictured right here. Last but not least, water mist fire extinguishers can only be pressurized using nitrogen, unlike a normal water fire extinguisher that can be pressurized using compressed air. So again, water mist fire extinguishers can only be pressurized using nitrogen. Whenever using a water mist fire extinguisher, start around 8 feet back from the fire. Then remember pass. Pull out the safety pin, aim the nozzle at the base of the fire, squeeze the levers, and sweep from side to side until the fire is extinguished. If it is an electrical fire that you are fighting, after putting out the fire, remember to de-energize any electrical equipment to prevent reignition. And as always, after using a portable fire extinguisher, Make sure to exit the building and wait for the fire department to arrive. Thank you everybody for watching today's fire extinguisher enthusiast video all about water mist fire extinguishers. I hope you learned something new and please remember to like, comment, subscribe and have a great and safe rest of your day.